Listen up, you fresh-faced greenhorn rookie. My name is Narmod Bowdershot. Yes, THE Narmod Bowdershot. Hero of Graveport, burned 30 ships on my own. Not here to regale on tales of triumph, though. I'm here to tell you about the many uncharted horizons of Aragon. And your role in charting them. Many a sour-faced curmudgeons will tell you that not everyone is born to be an adventurer. I say bollocks. Adventure is the core of every living being. You just gotta remove the dirt to reveal the gem. Now get to work, ya swaggish idler! Say what? You don't know where to start? Well, you should have said so! Listen up! This is a horse. Your trusty mount. You take care of it and raise it from, uh, whatever baby horses are called, into a mighty stallion. Then it will not only carry a but your garbage as well. Then you travel across Aragon and face its challenges. On the way, you make friends. You ever kill the guy? Yeah. And enemies. <laughs> and you'll find a horse wifey for your royal mount so they can make horse babies and live as a happy horse family before another adventurer like you takes the kids away and jumps in a volcano. <laughs> I often find sprouting pebbles like you thinking that adventuring means you don't go to work. Wrong! Hey man, I'm trying my best. Not only do you have to kill stuff and still uh, acquire their junk all over the place. Ooh, shiny. You also have to participate in the intricate economy of gathering, production, distribution, and exchange of goods. Isn't that exciting? Whatever craft you practice, you ain't isolated from the need of help from others. That's why you should give help in return. Our mutual codependence is truly a fascinating experience, just as the gods of order willed it. Nice work, guys. Then you ask me. But Narma, what do I need all these bricks and planks for? Am I building a house or something? Why, yes, you are! I hope your friends owe you favors, because you'll need to cash them out on this one. With your combined effort, materials, and the practice of each craft, you can make your dream house where you can do all the important things, like crafting, drinking tea, and having friends over. What? You've got too many friends, and they can't fit in your little house by the lake? First of all, show off. Second, just build a guild stronghold, your thick headed boulder brain. There, you and your buddies can practice all your crafts, drink more tea, and of course, dominate the entire area and its resources. Let's take a city. It's a house. The dungeons of Aragon are little trickery things. The stronger you get, the stronger they get. What kind of bollocks is that? The treasures get greater too, so there's that. Oh, and you can discover new ways to cast spells. Now, how's that for a more practical way to learn, huh? Ice cream! Tired of fighting monsters who most likely are part of the ecology and you're just terrorizing them? Oh! How about fighting your friends? Oh! The battlegrounds are endless points of conflict. Over there, you show off how much better you are at punching, burning, and healing stuff than the other team. You can outmatch them with your shiny gear or you can enter with just your skills. So they can truly know shame and defeat. And if you like things to be personal and you hate walking across big Why places, the arenas are the place for you. Where are you? <laughs> Come back here. Prove you are the like best in your world. class or the best overall I with various different modes that involve, you guessed it, punching more stuff. Alright, enough rattling off like a chattering brook. Why are you still here? Onward, took worry. 